Hi everyone, I never get to say welcome to my YouTube channel, so voila, I've said it, welcome to my YouTube channel. Today we are having a Boston tour party, so <laughs> let's go. Today you're going to get to see where I've been living in Boston. It's been 120 days since I moved to America, yay. So let's have this tour and then make breakfast while I tell you a little story about uh, life in Boston versus in Cape Town. So given that this is the Boston tour apartment, Boston apartment tour, you might be wondering why this is uh, a skyline that you're seeing and not exactly an apartment, but this is the point of view from when you're standing in my living room. Looking out the window, so as you can see, there's the, I guess, main TV and the Sorry, this is the apartment in a quick view, but we'll go in detail. Let's go to the door um, and start at the door. Um, but yeah, and so that is me, Jonathan Potok. I know the equation here. Uh, so I don't think I need to put on the lights, but you can recognize me because it's my YouTube channel. <laughs> so anyway this is the bedroom it's a nice very nice bed i definitely did not make it as you can see here like it's way too well done for it to have been done by me i had some help um <clears throat> but uh it's pretty oh by the way um have you subscribed yet because like uh yeah nearly at 1200 so if you like subscribe it would really help me get close to that and if you're subscribed you're awesome thank you thank you thank you so much <sighs> anyway um goodness me it feels nice to jump on beds guys uh so what am i saying yeah guys so that is the closet i guess where my clothes are um some of them or most of them if not all of them and uh, it's real nice that I can actually... Oh, yeah. Still here. <laughs> anyway, uh, that's the closet. So you might have noticed that I've got a window here. Uh, a very big window. Ta -da -da -da. It's... Uh, I closed it so you could see because it brings in a lot of light and then ruins the video image as you can see like everything is blue it's really uh, because this view blew me away <laughs> but if you look through the window you can see that i um, live on the 13th floor very high very very high i do not have to take stairs luckily for me but i do get this somewhat city life view of all these uh, skyscrapers very few trees in sight but i am next to the common gardens which is a public garden with lots and lots and lots of trees that are full of snow right now but yeah look at that without the blue um effect which i think is something to do with exposure anyway but yeah can we see the traffic uh, in the left corner and uh, that is uh, the view that I have in this room and there is uh, the bed guys I've got a nice TV here uh, just although I don't I'm not one to watch much uh, I and mean, these are the drawers where my stuff sit and those are my shoes so I like having the TV here, but I'm not one to watch TV before sleeping or even at all in the bedroom. I think in the bedroom, all you should do is go to sleep. And so that's what mostly I do in here. So this TV gets not used at all. It's not used much. Oh, and I forgot to say one more thing. I need to find someone's daughter to share this bed with because it's way too big, you know? So. Uh, ladies, please send your CVs through to by subscribing to my YouTube channel. 
I'm joking. It's very important to say you are joking after making a joke like that. Um, <laughs> anyway, here we are in the bathroom. Sorry about the mess here. Ooh, this should go into the laundry basket. And I forgot to flush it. And that's my loofah with little showers, I guess. But yeah, this is the uh, bathroom. It's a nice toilet pot that I do stuff on. And two nice drawers with some of my stuff in. And equation. Anyway, here we go. Uh, and uh, when you get here, this is where the washing machine and the dryer are. It's a beautiful. Oh, I need to move these into a dryer. I'll do that afterwards. And here is my coffee maker that I pretty much never use. All these dirty issues here. I am so sorry, my subscribers. But I think my video editor can actually edit this out, so I'm not too worried. I have faith in him. And here, I just opened my new gimbal, and uh, DJ, which is what I'm using right now to stabilize these videos. But this is where all the cooking happens. Where uh, ah, and the oven that I have never used, like never ever. The couch that I definitely have used. The TV that you just saw. Here's my workstation and my notes on the wall. I hope you can't read this at all. Because some of them are secrets. And this is where the musical magic that you see on this YouTube channel happens, right here. Well, that was my apartment, guys. I hope you found it nice and you can see that I live in a decent space. <laughs> Not the best. I think it could be better, but I think it's great. Like if I can build a studio, like a full blown studio, um, it will be great. But I can't exactly want to afford to have a second room that I'm just keeping for studio right now because that's kind of what I need. But one day, keep dreaming. Anyway, so my apartment in Cape Town, I think, was just about as nice. Oh, in case you haven't noticed, we've started story time because, as you can see, I am busy making breakfast. Uh, so uh, first, and, and also, by the way, do not judge my cooking. I am a very good cook. Um, I cook very well. I have lots of years of experience. I'm just not as well invested in the appearance of my food as I people might be. But my food tastes nice. Thank you. Anyway, as I was saying, my apartment in Cape Town, I think, was just about as nice as this one, but it definitely did not cost as much as this one does. Boston is so damn expensive, it's painful. But this is America, the greatest country in the world. <laughs> and before moving here, I really did not know that Boston is pretty much as expensive as New York. I knew that New York was expensive, and I used to think that Cape Town was expensive. Now I know that Cape Town is tiny shame. So I came here thinking, uh, Boston will be affordable, but Dololo, that's the title of one of my songs. Anyway, <clears throat> I like that it is a, a big city, Boston. I really like it. I like the um, demographics of people I see. I do wish there were a little bit more people of color here, but then again, um, you can't always have everything you want. But then I've been told there's actually some parts where it is and just that I'm in downtown and that's why. Uh, but I, I like that there's quite a bit of diversity here so that I feel comfortable, etc. There's also a lot of students, yay. I seem to always end up in areas where there's lots of students. But what I like about it is that it doesn't have the things that make New York infamous or the notorious drama that New York has. Um, <clears throat> so I'm getting like a little bit of the good stuff. And to some extent, to some extent. Anyway, once summer arrives, I'll start really exploring it a lot. And because this winter actually is my first real, real winter. I used to think that we have winter in South Africa, but no, that's just summer taking it easy. But I've seen winter here, my word. Never in my wildest dreams did I think that people can live in a place where the outside is colder than your fridge. Like, my fridge is warmer than most of the time. 
the temperature that it's been in the past started with two three months that i've been here but anyway i'll uh, also hopefully get to shoot a music video here similar to the hosanna one so that you can actually get to see the beauty of this city but that's going to definitely leave a hole in my pocket and uh since everything here is so expensive but um, hopefully by that time um, you would have shared this video with all your friends and all the other videos on my channel so that I can get the channel monetized and then earn money f from YouTube so I can pay for the music video so thank you in advance for subscribing liking and commenting even if you just have to say hashtag equation in the comment thank you um, if you like the background music, well, that's my latest single, Listen Up, which is available to be streamed pretty much everywhere, well, except SoundCloud, because I kind of forgot to upload it there, but I'm going to do that real, real soon. In the meantime, you can listen to it now, as I finish up my breakfast making. Keep solving equations, and bye. <laughs> listen up, listen up, baby. I'm only going to say this once. I'm giving up on that same old love I'm taking back my heart today I need you out of my life ASAP I'm gonna go back for you I'm gonna let's kiss for you And if this message breaks your heart, baby Well, what comes around goes around Summer change from the inside out I can't even recognize myself in the mirror I'm just a figment of your imagination Here I am battling with addictions I never even knew existed I feel it's rock, it's rock bottom But it's okay cause from here there's only Only one way, only one way Can you listen up baby? Listen up, listen up baby I'm only gonna say this once Today I'm giving up on that same old love I'm taking back my heart today I need you out of my life face up I'm gonna go back for you I'm gonna let's kiss for you And if this message breaks your heart baby Oh what comes around goes Apologies, I've already forgiven you, I've already started my recuperation So I don't wanna see your face, I don't wanna hear your voice And tell me you love me cause you're not capable